guitar. I'm Danny, I play drums. I'm Dimitri, and I play guitar. I'm Claire, I sing. I'm Sua, and I play the bass. Awesome! So, where did you meet and form this band? Uh, me and Michael and Sua had guitar class together like <laughs> sophomore year. You're sophomore, my freshman year. Oh, man, whatever. It only counts for us. Uh, I love you too. Yeah, I guess me and Dimitri are like the heads of this band. <laughs> Two heads. Which one are you two? You look Never. insulted. <laughs> <laughs> um, I don't know. Like I remember talking about my, Michael was in another band. That yeah, he band. was her. Yeah, I was time. in a few other bands. And then and me and Sue went over to Michael's house one day. We just just started yeah, jamming, and making some tunes, and Space Jam it was like this should be a thing. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> <laughs> we should make it official, Michael. Yeah. Like Facebook. And then you guys find Danny. Well. We were looking for a drummer for a long time. We were looking we had for a drummer person. and a singer. Yeah, we were, we for, a were long, looking for a long, long hard time. After going through some other band that we yeah. were. And, and I was a friend of a friend, and yeah. I came and I auditioned, and, and here we are. And, and I, I, found I found them on Craigslist. Craigslist. That is a true story. That's a true story. We found a 15-year-old girl on Craigslist. I I I text I texted Michael. Fifteen year old girls text Michael. And then we started talking. And then I just sh I showed up to uh, a house I've never been to with four large men. Went into the backyard. That I never met. I went to the backyard. She went to our shed. And I closed sang. the door. And then we whipped out <laughs> the operating table and we okay. took out our kidneys. <laughs> I still have Perfect it recovered. Story. Awesome. Next question. Um, no. Where you're in? <laughs> oh, this shit. I'm not. No, I'm kidding. Anyway. So the answer is I like turtles. <laughs> what are your inspirations as a band and as a person? Who inspires you? Kmart. Kmart. <laughs> Turtles. Smith. Turtles. See, I knew the answer would be turtles. Okay, Claire is my individual. Turtles. Yes. Right, Claire, Claire, has the four. Claire has the four. Well, it all started when well, I was, was younger. Fine. <laughs> and that's enough. I for actually, Claire. I like uh, for guitar because I play a little guitar. I like Jimi Hendrix and Eric Clapton. But for songwriting, some of my. Uh, well, the artist that really got me into like songwriting and singing was John Mayer. And I know that sounds really like mainstream and stuff, but I thought he's really talented. <laughs> and so, and so that that he's one of my biggest inspirations. Let's go free to be mainstream because I'm a hipster. Yeah, so we gotta balance it somehow. <laughs> as well as like the Sex Pistols. Like, everywhere you just find the Sex Pistols. Uh, I love the Sex Pistols. Is this next? my turn? Sure. Yeah. Um, well, <laughs> growing up, I didn't have much of a really diverse musical influence. My mom taught me to appreciate music, but she mainly listened to funk and dance music from the 80s, and I didn't get much there. Um, you guys think I'm joking. No, every day in the car, it's like listening to freaking cameo and shit. Um, so, um, and then uh, whenever, like, action movies and stuff, they would always have, like, a music video at the end, like, from some band that I had no idea who they were, but I always was drawn to heavier stuff, and... I just kind of branched out on my own, listening to stuff like Disturbed, Linkin Park, Five Finger Death Punch, and uh, from there, you know, Mikey asked me to be in a band, and I was like, oh, cool, was, yeah, and sure. And blossomed. Yeah, I blossomed. I'm a beautiful butterfly now. <laughs> yeah. I mean, I guess we all kind of, like, we really have, like, a wide variety of influences of the band, for sure. I mean, a lot of our songs are pretty different from one another because of the fact that we base it off of each other's ideas, and then we put them all together, and... Uh, it just comes out different with every song, I guess I would say. Yeah. Alright, awesome. So I'm going to take a different turn, but what would you do for a Klondike bar? Oh god. <laughs> Michael's answer is going to be turtles. <laughs> Dimitri's answer is going to be turtles and ignore Matt. F -A. Um, I would I don't like ice so cream. So his name is F. In so Spanish. I wouldn't do anything for a Klondike bar. Wow. Klondike. I think they kill you for a Klondike bar. That means bar. boss. That. Yeah. But, you, know. yeah. you guys F already knew boss, that. Like, no, I'm shocked. Right. Well, you guys, F we went to a freaking cold stone together, and then I was like, oh, I don't like ice cream. No. And then you guys like, yelled at me for like a good thing. I don't remember like that. Ice cream. We were in cold stone. You don't like ice cream? Ice cream is nasty. It makes your throat dry. You gotta get water afterwards. It's nasty. What? For a Klondike bar, I would behave myself. <laughs> for what? Five that's minutes? A, that's a funny For what, a 30 <laughs> second span, maybe? Maybe. Not was, even that. <laughs> I would sit contently as I ate the Klondike bar, which means I'd inhale it. I and just I'd get back to what I was doing. Because it. I'm an adult. I love you too, dude. <laughs> Alright, awesome. Um, let's see. 
What's your message as a fan? Like, do you? Oh yeah, Michael. Why don't you tell us our message? As Are you guys like hopeful? Or you use the word screw your own. Uh, we're, we're hopeful. I have too many people wanting me to say things. <laughs> I gotta let Claire answer this. Claire, okay. Uh, this is something we have been discussing as a band. Yeah, we've been trying to figure quite it out. a while. We have. And I think that that is part of our image or what we represent is variety. Like we just jump around. Oh, Basically, if you listen to our songs, it's kind of just a bunch of different sounds and things like that. So I think we represent individuality, creativity, as cliche as that sounds. But I think that's what we usually strive for. Yeah, yeah. I agree. And like. Don't limit yourself to just one thing. I mean, if we were all like-minded people, our music wouldn't be as diverse as it is. All right, that's awesome. Um, along those same lines, what's your genre? Do you genre? Oh, genre? Oh, like Good luck with this one. Rock. We just call it metal. Oh, we say alternative. We're so metal. Pop no rock. Idea. With I'm so metal. I rush to the shower. Like like no, I have a guitar pick. Rock. Pop rock alternative. What is that? Why is it still in your pocket? <laughs> Why not? Anyway, I have two more questions. So I heard someone in this band has an alter ego. Sula, come on. What? <laughs> what is that? <laughs> Are you gonna use words? Or? And no. <laughs> Next question. Someone in the band has an alter ego, apparently. And I'm not someone answering this. We don't talk about Okay, so there's this thing no, that happens whenever. <laughs> Feel free to cut this out if you like. Um, but this is this is just. For oh shit. no, not vulgar! Right? Yep. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> so there's this thing where, when Michael goes into an excessive anger mode. He is. He is known I like turtles. as Mogart. He is no longer Michael, and Mogart does not know what Michael does, and vice versa. How much is this getting cut out? For example, very embarrassing video. For example, Michael would never go to a zoo. Never, ever. In a million years, he sees no point. Where did the zoo come from? Mogar would go to a zoo just to beat every animal to death for the sake of doing it. I was going to say, some of the story is original. We're done with this question. Yeah, that's, 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 that's the next question. What's the next question? What's the next question? Can we move on? Well, with all of our interviews, we always end with truth or dare. Oh, oh child. <laughs> um, let's see, someone has licked that wall, someone has jumped in that trash can, someone has jumped off this. Okay, that's going to be nearly as bad if any of us dare. You can get away to do anything, I will. as long as it doesn't require nudity. That's fine. If it does, I will. No, no. There's no duty like, on this. Not to with anyone. All right, so someone can dare anyone. Minimum one person. So somebody has to take a dare. I hate yeah. Sula. So. So. <laughs> <laughs> How did I know this was coming? <laughs> Alright. Well, so, can we all ask the same person? <laughs> no. Yeah, why not? There's really no rules to this. Ah, there's no rules. Is it truth or dare? I will dare me to do something. Yeah. Truth or dare. Me? But it, no, you I said it's it truth or Yeah. Um, I'm just kidding. Who do you like? I don't know. <laughs> like, like or like like? No one remembers. Like like. Like like. I like Klondike Bar. I like Daddy. I really love Alright, alright, come yeah. on, seriously, let's, let's, let's no see. Okay, okay, okay. Let someone do something. Okay. Alright. So who wants to be the victim? Or the person? The person to do the Cheap asking? The or to do the. I'll, I'll go first. Okay. I will be the guinea pig. Truly there. Uh, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. Okay. Alright, so who wants to be the victim? Or the person? Or the person? Or the person? Or the person? Oh, there is so much stuff you could do either way. <laughs> um. <laughs> Uh, Don't hurt yourself. Let's go. Let's go with. Let's go with um. Fuck. Truth. Let's go with truth. <laughs> what? What? This is not gonna be even a valid oh, question. I feel like. You can do whatever you want. You can do it. You said truth or death, so you gotta ask. What up? I feel like you're gonna get mad. You're gonna get mad. My own personal version. You're gonna get really mad. It. It's okay. I'm protecting you. You'll do it. <laughs> Why are you afraid of me? Because I feel like an asshole if I ask it too. Me too. Just do it. <laughs> if you're gonna do something, it's the, the one thing that you get really mad about. You do realize that doesn't limit the spectrum at all. <laughs> the, the one thing. The one thing. That's funny. He doesn't right? any anything. I do. What 
I apologize. Like, I'll, I'll, ask it. I'll, I'll ask it. 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 i we need to finish off with something funny as a dare. Fine. None of this has been funny. I'll, I'll be a dare. <laughs> you could do catch the vocalist. I'll be a dare or a dare. Oh, we did catch the vocalist. Listen, I'd rather do a catch dare if vocalist. that's the question Catch you the asked. vocalist. They, someone picked up the, him, the vocalist. He was in the Insomnia Effect interview. And they threw the vocalist to the bassist, and then to the guitarist, and then to the bassist. I don't think I'm light enough for that. Ah, uh, that doesn't sound funny. Does he look light <laughs> enough for that? <laughs> Fucking look at him! Only one thirty. The man's bones are like dense as shit. He's like heavier than that garbage can, I guarantee you. <laughs> what the fuck? Wait, what? Self-esteem, jeez. Okay. I, think I didn't he say it was awesome. bad, I said he was dense. Okay. Which means <laughs> dense. He's okay. got muscle. So different. What the fuck? I, I know the truth. Does anybody have a dare for Sula? Right, I, I, I will do a dare. I will do a dare. truth, then he has to do dare. As long as it doesn't... Okay, hold on. Hold on, I'm down. about to make... Really? That's a dare for me? I don't fucking care. Just do it. I just saw that evil smile. Get it over. <laughs> like, what is he doing? Like, <laughs> <laughs> this is the Mother th Earth! <laughs> yeah! I hope your mom watches this. <laughs> okay. Can Finally, I we got that over. Okay. Right. Something us. else. <laughs> I was <laughs> expecting something a little I more think, challenging. They were both confused I right care. now. <laughs> that was a bad I got a dare for the dare. That oh wasn't God. a very good dare. I'm kidding. Never mind. Okay, about to say, what, what's the dare? I thought oh, she was willing to do it. Too. Oh. What is it? I wasn't going to do it. I was joking. Punch you guys can dare me. Punch Michael in the face. He's too nice, I can't do that. <laughs> Whoa! Claire's, Claire's deer is to punch him in the face, and Michael's deer is to stand there. <laughs> punch me. You gotta oh, no. Okay, Claire. Why are you guys doing that? Get the angle. Get the anger. Now, are you you get the anger. anger towards me. Who are you? I gotta imagine now, someone else. Right punch. when it's punch about to hit. You gotta cut it. The so Steven like the and the girl who stole your phone is one person now. Ooh, child, it's about to get real. <laughs> this girl stole my phone. Ooh, why are you? Man. Why are you the fuck out of here? She got a Superman punch in the last night. Like like this. <laughs> I gotta get. <laughs> gotta get a. Uh, no you gotta get aim from <laughs> first. That makes perfect your face? sense. My phone. Okay. Yeah, you power. just stand here. You stand there <laughs> and punch. You have one foot back and you pivot. I can move. Really so you throw a punch. <laughs> what was that? Uh, what this was is that? how you punch a man. <laughs> sure. <laughs> Shit, I almost tripped. Okay, thank you guys. We usually end up with a funny pose. So just pose for the camera. And we're done in three, two, one. Thank you guys.